I'm going to quickly go through some of the exercises in uh, questions in exercise 5.4. We're going to start with 1A. And again, uh, I've already got video lessons that accompany this topic, so I'm just going to uh, fly through these questions. So in 1A, we have a cost price of $48 and an amount of markup of $12. So I'm, I'm going to advocate the use, uh, not the use of the formulas. I'm certainly not going to prevent you from using the formula sheet. You have the formula sheet, you know what it looks like. So if you wish to use that formula sheet, feel free. But I, I like to uh, follow a very simplistic approach to these problems because we know that selling price minus cost price is equal to markup. This is in line with your income statement. In the income statement, we start off with total sales minus uh, cost of goods sold is equal to uh, your gross profit. And so this is exactly in line with everything that we've learned in accounting. So sales minus cost is equal to markup. We know that the cost price is $48, so I'll mark that. And I know that the markup is $12, and we're asked to determine the selling price and the markup rate based on cost and the markup rate based on sales. So, um, again, common sense. If I need to subtract $48 to get $12, what is the amount that goes up in the top row? Well, naturally, uh, what goes up here is the $60, because 60 minus 48 will give me 12 or 48 plus 12 will give me 60. So now I know using a common sense approach, no formula is necessary, just an understanding that um, sales minus cost is equal to markup. So we know that the selling price is equal to $60. And so the next question is, what is the markup rate based on uh, cost price? And that markup rate based on cost price is always a ratio. It's a percentage. And that ratio is the ratio of markup to cost. And in this case, we've got markup to cost. Markup is $12. Cost price is $48. When you work this out on your calculator, you end up with 0 0.25, which is 25%. So a 25% markup based on cost is what we have here. The other question was, what is the markup rate based on selling price? And that markup rate based on selling price is equal to a ratio. And that ratio is the ratio of markup to selling price. The amount of markup is $12. The uh, selling price is $60. And a ratio of 12 to 60 will be 1 out of 5, and 1 out of 5 is 20%. So a markup rate based on sales is 20%. So what we can say here is that a 20% markup based on cost is equivalent to a 25, sorry, a 20% markup based on sales is equivalent to a 25% markup based on cost.